Hey everybody, Plush Boy Q here, back with another Jurassic World review. I was totally not expecting this review, you know, at all. Let's turn the flash on. How do I turn the flash on? It's, it's my ugly face. Um, so I'm still using the croc. I find, you know, the croc actually works. But I did already open this. But let's take a look at the barcode. Th this can be found at Walmart stores. Um, this retails for $14.99, I think. I don't have the Dilophosaurus, but I do have a JP3 uh, Hammond Clutch and Raptor I can use to compare this with. And this is definitely much bigger. And it actually is much better in, in some ways, which I'm trying to balance this, sh this sh phone on. Damn it. Oh, one second. Let me see if I can get this to work. I got big crocs. Damn it. If I don't turn this off, I'll break my shoe in the process. There. Oh, that's not going to work. Um, damn it. Damn it. How do I turn? Pause it. All right. This is this falling down. All right, cool. So let's take a look at the head, which is probably the best looking part on this. It's a lot harder to film with the busted screen on the phone. Can't find the where the flash is at. Um, so the head, it looks really good. It looks more accurate than the Hammond collection when I give them a point for that. Uh, the paint on the head looks pretty decent. I don't mind. The only thing I'm kind of little damn it on are the eyes that are actually the slit pupil, which they should not have done that. They got the little I'll call them crests on the head. They got that correct. They should be a reddish orange color. They got the jaw base color, the sand, but the only thing I don't like about it is that they kind of have a big gap from here to the belly. Um, the quills are not painted white, but I'll give them a pass for that. Just They don't look bad. This is I actually got another one to repaint. So you got a white stripe that goes all the way down to here. The arms and legs don't have paint on them at all, so there's no, you know, it's Mattel. The arms can move like that. And the legs can move like that as well. Um, as I said, there's some paint on the belly. And they have the, the battery piece to go there as well. Here's, oh. Let me get that scan code nice and focused for you. There's scan code for those who would like to unlock it. The tail can kind of spin like that, but it's a really pointless piece. Uh, now let's go over the action feature. I do agree that th this is sort of a fat raptor. They probably shouldn't have made it, you know, this big. I would honestly like the I like the light feature on these, but I don't like um, whatever you call this. And the the the, the other side of the head looks just as nice as the front, the left side. <laughs> Um, scan code kind of looks odd, but I'm getting used to that. I miss them being on the feet. Um, uh, let's see, all right, the light feature, let's see it. Oops. It's got, th it has three, three different sounds. It's got like a... A scream, a hiss, and a growl. Um, yeah, this is about all I can say about that. Oh, I'll get the other Hammond Raptor. All right, I don't know how well this is, how long this is gonna stand up for it, but here's this new Epic Attack Raptor. Might have just have to hold the damn screen. And I have another tripod. I ordered it off of Walmart.com. It's coming. They're out of stock everywhere on the one I use. And here's the other 
a brand new one. Actually, I'm just gonna keep it like this. A bit harder. Get it to focus. But let, I'm gonna fix the feet on the other one. But yeah, this one, I, I, so I was just, just gonna say what, they both are good, damn it. Is the paint on my grandpa's stupid fucking alarm keeps going off. It's annoying. The paint on the Hammond one is always and obviously better, but the sculpt on the Epic Attack one is much better. I honestly like the size of the other, the Epic Attack. I feel like the other one's too small. Depending on what you put it next to. If you put it with other Hammond figures, it don't look bad. But when you put it next to all the other Raptors, the Epic Attack one would be better. But yeah, the Hammond one is dwarfed by the Epic Attack Raptor. But they're both really good in their own ways. And I'd honestly recommend picking up both of these if you can. I've seen Best Buy stores sell the Hammond one. And Walmart sell the epic attack they sell all the epic attacks there but um I'm trying to think damn it the, this raptor the epic attack one took me so long to find this i was literally searching and nearly th i searched in two different states for that raptor and i could not find it in four major cities so i'm going to get off i got to go i'm going to turn this review off I hope you guys enjoyed. Have a great one and peace.